You're watching the Financial News Network. I'm Chuck Pierce. Here's your latest earnings update. Molson Coors reported first quarter earnings this morning, posting an EPS of 47 cents, topping estimates of 43 cents a share. Revenues in the quarter came in at $691.4 million, missing estimates of $703.5 million. The company said its worldwide beer volume was down 0.4 percent and sees annual underlying tax rate of 17 to 21 percent. Molson Coors Coors Light sales to retail rose 4 percent, driven by volume growth and market share gains in Canada, the U.S. and the U.K. Molson Coors President and Chief Executive Officer Peter Swinburne said, quote, In the first quarter, underlying earnings per share grew 9.3 percent on positive beer pricing and sales mix across our company, along with continued results from cost savings initiatives and stock repurchases in the second half of last year. By segment, the U.S. posted a strong quarter with underlying earnings growth nearly 17 percent, while U.K. and Canada underlying pre-tax income declined from a year ago. The U.S. benefited from its strongest net sales per hectoliter quarter in three years. In Canada and the U.K., we faced margin pressure from higher pension and input inflation, as well as increased marketing investments in the U.K. and cycling one-time costs in Canada. Despite the challenges, we continue to invest in our key brands across our company and to fill our innovation pipeline. Molson Coors is down over 2% in early trading to $41.04. For further updates, stay tuned. You're watching the Financial News Network. I'm Chuck Pierce.